lovelies my name is Jessica and welcome to make a miss it and I am so excited I just had a package finally dropped off I had this shipped to the border because it was cheaper for me to ship it to the border which I'm like 45 minutes away from an hour than it was to get it shipped to my door it did sit there for about a week but that's okay I have a package from Ensley Rain this is the very first package I have place with them and I am so excited. There's been a couple of palettes that I've had my eye on. I've heard such good things. I haven't been keeping up with them too much with reviews and stuff like that, but I just finally bit the bullet, bought this palette, and I'm so excited. So I'm going to unbox this with you guys, and I'm ready to dive into it. As you can tell, I already started, and then I was like, nope, I'm getting ahead of myself. I'm going to sit down and film this unboxing with you. So, um... We're just going to get into this. I don't know what I'm talking about here. Okay, so we're going to finish opening up this box. Okay. So we have some super cute packaging. It looks like it's packaged very well. Oh, it is about the size of the... Holy, this is a large box. I bought the Groovy Garden palette, and I am so excited. There, like I said, are a couple palettes that I have been curious about. This, of course, being one of them. The Strawberry Moon being another. Um, previous to them revamping it. The Cold Moon is another one. I think the Harvest Moon, I believe it is, is a little too dark for me. So I won't ever be wanting to dive into that one but I'm so excited to start off with the groovy garden I think that this color story is perfect for me especially with this hair color the strawberry moon was the first palette that I really wanted to get but I think I'm gonna hold off on that one a little bit cold moon I'm starting to like it a little bit more it is a cooler color story of course but I think it's absolutely beautiful but I'm so excited that this is the first palette that I'm going to be trying from them so let's dive into this and open up the box the packaging is beautiful and I'm they 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 really go all out <laughs> definitely worth the extra couple of dollars so here's what the packaging looks like we are going to slide it out I do get rid of these I don't hold on to them however this box I think I'm going to be holding on to I feel like something just slid from here probably the plastic piece. This is stunning. This is also going to go away. Oh, you guys, I know. <laughs> oh, this is like perfect fall time, but like perfect with my hair color. I'm so, so excited about this. This color right here, I believe is called Free Spirit. Just has me right now. I cannot wait to dip into this. Um, before I sat down to film, I was planning on doing a combined video of the unboxing plus doing a look. I won't be able to do a look anytime soon, so I think I might do that in a separate video if you guys want. Let me know down below. I'm going to, um, I might be able to do that next weekend. So I don't know when this video is going up. I'm going to try and get it up within a couple of days of me filming this and then hopefully by that weekend I will have time to actually sit down in the morning on the Saturday and film a look. So let me know if that's something that you guys would like me to do because I'm so excited to dive into this palette. It is absolutely stunning and I like the fact that these are magnetic and you can actually take them out and like reverse them if you want because you have these little dips there which it makes it so much easier to take out shadows from palettes I find it absolutely amazing that this brand does that um and I know the strawberry moon is now like that however a couple of the shades I think in that palette have been like switched around from what the original layout was which kind of threw me ever so slightly but I still like I still want it there's nothing that makes me not want that palette um so I think that might be my next one. Oh, look it kind of matches my nails the blue up here and this oh my goodness and then the white and then not really but we can pretend <laughs> that was unintentional I promise but this is so pretty whoa let me know if you guys have this palette or any other Ensley Rain palette like I said I've heard such good things about the formula that I'm so excited to test this out and 
It definitely is pricey, especially in Canadian. I had it shipped to the border and even with the conversion, I still saved myself like a whole $50, which was probably just the shipping alone to get it shipped to my house. It was going to cost me over $150, almost $160 Canadian, and it cost me $100, $100 to get it shipped to the border and pick it up from there, and that was after conversion. So it definitely still saved me some time and some, well, some money, even though I had to wait an extra week to pick it up. That's whatever. I'm happy. I have it now. I'm so excited for this. I think that it is absolutely stunning. The artwork is beautiful as well. So like I said, let me know if you have this palette or any other one. And I'm so excited to dive into this. I think besides Free Spirit, like I'm so excited about these shimmers. I don't know if any of these are multi-chromes. I'm assuming some of them are. Free Spirit is, Jazzed is, Lava Lamp is. Oh, Lava Lamp. That's such a cute name. And then some of these, I'm just like, yes. I don't want to swatch it right now, though, because it's just way too way too new and pretty for that. But I'm definitely, like, loving this. And then this box, I'm keeping this. Like, I normally don't keep packaging, like, stuff like this. But, like, this box, 100%, I'm holding on to. Don't know what I'm going to put into it yet, but we will figure that out when the time comes. But I am excited. So let me know, like I said, especially if there's any colors in here that you think that I should test out. Give me a couple look ideas if there's anything in here that you think I would uh, like to use or that you want to see me try and use. I don't know if I'm going to do a palette bingo with this, but I definitely just want to like play with it. Um, and I have a feeling that like next year this is definitely going into mm. one of my panning projects. I will be right back. Mm neighbor who actually went to go pick this up for me just called to <laughs> check in to see how I'm enjoying it so <laughs> um yeah I just put this back in the thing so I'm gonna put this away now I'll call this done but like I said if there's any colors in here that you want me to use or test out or anything like that let me know let me know if you've had this palette any other palettes what you think of the formula and I'm just so excited so Thank you guys for watching. I really do appreciate it. And that is it for now. So I will see you guys all later. Bye.